If you are fully vaccinated and boosted, doctors say there is at least one more shot you should consider, the flu vaccine. Our ABC 10 News anchor Derek Stahl has taken an in-depth look at evidence that suggests the flu shot might offer some indirect protection against COVID. Officially, the CDC says a flu vaccine will not protect you against COVID, but several studies have found signs it might. Last year, researchers at the University of Miami analyzed medical records on nearly 75,000 people who had tested positive for COVID. They found people who had gotten a flu vaccine beforehand had a 20% lower risk of winding up in the ICU. The risk of blood clots, sepsis, or stroke dropped by even more. Another study analyzed adults over 65 in the U.S. and found similar results. People who had gotten a flu vaccine had a 24% lower chance of getting infected with COVID and a 28% lower chance of developing severe disease from it. However, neither study pinpointed the cause of the protection. Was it something actually in the flu vaccine or something else? It's hard to know uh, whether you can hang your hat on it, but it's, it's not unheard of to have someone's immune system get revved up. Uh, and in some sort of a non-specific way, provide some level of protection against uh, something else. For nearly 100 years, researchers have found examples of one vaccine offering protection against a different virus or bacteria. In general, they think it's because vaccines activate the body's most primitive defenses that guard against all infections, what's called the innate immune system. The theory has been around for a long time, uh, and I think that with the right stimulus, you might have a, a, a beneficial effect, uh, but it's not going to be the same kind of effect you get from a, vac a, a COVID vaccine or for something that's more directed, and it won't be as long lasting. UC San Diego's Dr. Robert Schooley thinks these studies might be skewed by what's called healthy user bias. People that get an annual flu vaccine might also be more health conscious overall or more likely to wear masks. He says the flu vaccine just doesn't jumpstart our generalized defenses for very long. It's a very trivial tweak to the innate immune system and probably for a couple of days uh, keeps you tuned in, but it's not going to do this over the weeks and months of a COVID season. The researchers in Miami acknowledge the flu vaccine likely offers only a small layer of added protection against COVID. But this week, scientists at Cornell estimated that even just an extra 5% protection from the flu vaccine could substantially reduce COVID cases and the burden on hospitals and help flatten the curve. Derek Stahl, ABC 10 News. Derek, and you might have heard that this year's flu shot isn't a good match against the circulating strain right now. We checked with experts and they say that is partially true. The flu shot contains four strains. Doctors say one of the four isn't a good match, but the other three they are holding up well and the flu shot is worth getting.